Today's scripture reading begins in verse 24 of Proverbs chapter 11. There is one who scatters and yet increases all the more, and there is one who withholds what is justly due, and yet it results only in poverty. A generous person will be prosperous, and one who gives others plenty of water will himself be given plenty. One who withholds grain, the people will curse him, but blessing will be on the head of him who sells it. One who diligently seeks good seeks favor, but one who seeks evil, evil will come to him. One who trusts in his riches will fall, but the righteous will flourish like the green leaf. God is the ultimate giver, and in gratitude, those of us who are believers are to imitate Him. As He provides us with material wealth and possessions, we become channels through whom He blesses others and carries out His work on earth. Becoming a generous person begins with biblical thinking. Remember our Heavenly Father's goodness and love, which prompted Him to send His Son to die in our place. He did this to provide us with the riches of eternal life. Acknowledge that God owns all the world's resources, and whatever you have is a gift from His hand. Release your grip on earthly wealth, then trust the Lord to meet your needs and share generously. Realize that church is a means not only for spreading the gospel, but also for helping the needy and supporting those in ministry. Invest your time, talent, and treasure in God's kingdom. As followers of Christ, we're to give faithfully to the church we attend and to those in need. By generously offering back to the Lord a portion of all He's given us, we'll experience genuine joy, peace, and security. These blessings are of far greater value than anything the material world has to offer.